Hello students, my name is Sumit Mehta. So today in this lecture we will discuss some question based on laws of exponent which I have discussed in my previous lecture. The laws of exponent which I have discussed in my two previous lecture. Okay, so watch that video on laws of exponent if you want to solve the question based on these. Okay, so I am giving you one question first. It is 2 raised to power 3 into 3 raised to power 4 into 4 upon 3 into 32. So students, all the questions which I will be discussing in this lecture are some typical questions which might come into exam. So please do focus here. Okay. So can I write 2 raised to power 3 as it is and 3 raised to power 4 and 4 as 2 into 2. Okay. Now comes to denominator part. Can I write 32 as 2 multiply 2 multiply 2 multiply 2 means in the least common factor. So 2 raised to power 2 into this is. So here I am using the law a raised to power m into a raised to power n is equals to a raised to power m plus n. So this is 2 raised to power 2. So 3 plus 2 is 5 into 3 raised to power 4. In the denominator I am this is 3 into 2 raised to power 5. So 2 raised to power 2 5 into 2 raised to power 5 will cut and the we are left with 2 raised 3 raised to power 5 my minus 1. So here I have used a raised to power m upon a raised to power n is equals to a raised to power m minus n. So student in the bracket I am writing which formula I am using in this question. So this is 3 raised to power 3 which is 27 only. So student these are type of some typical questions which might come into exam. So please be attentive here. Uh, I am right now. Now I am moving to another question. Okay. So student, this is the very typical questions which might come into exam. So be attentive here. Here we are given 2 raised to power 5 raised to power 2. Power of a power. So what I have told you in my previous lecture, whenever there is a power of a power, we will multiply both this power, means a raised to power m into n. So can I write 2 raised to power 10, now into 7 raised to power 3. Now if I can say, this is, if I can express 2 raised to power 8 into 2 raised to power 3, simply, because 2 raised to power 3 is 8. So now this is also become my case of, a raised to power m power n which is mn so 2 raised to power 10 into 7 raised to power 3 upon my 2 raised to power 3 into 3 will be 9 into 7 so 10 minus 9 into 7 raised to power 3 minus 1 because here I am using the formula a upon a to power m upon a to power n is equal to a to power m minus n so student in the bracket I am writing all the formulas which I am using from the laws of exponent. So this is 2 raised to power 1 into 7 raised to power 2 which means 2 into 7 square. So 7 square is 49 into 2 is 98. So this is our answer student. I hope now you guys can easily attempt any question based on this. Let me discuss one more question which is a simple question based on uh, any uh, exponent with zero power so students this is the question given to us and we have to find out the value of this expression so 2 raised to power 0 plus 3 raised to power 0 plus 4 raised to power 0 so student here I will use any known zero integer raised to power 0 will be 1 means here the base should not be equal to 0 so this is 1 this is also 1 this is also 1 so 1 plus 1 plus 1 is 3 so student, I have covered all type of questions which might come into exam and if you have already watched that video then you will face no difficulty in your exam. Okay and practice all the questions from your exercise and if you are facing any doubt or any question then please do comment in the comment section students. I will be happy to help you guys there and also download the app of Scholar Learning from app store or play store and if you have already did that then please do share it among your friends thank you students happy learning